Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel and welcome back to my summer wardrobe essential series. And today is part two. We're gonna be talking all things jewelry and accessories from like straw hats to sunnies, a lot of designer dupes in this video. And no surprise, I'm wearing like one of my favorite hair bands. I'm gonna share like my hair band collection, lots of different accessories in this video and stay tuned. I'm definitely gonna be doing a part three with summer shoes, like sandals and all my favorites but I'm also thinking maybe of doing a part four and I'm trying to decide on maybe another category, like maybe swimwear and like cover-ups. But you guys will have to let me know if you have any other suggestions for this series. I could add on as many videos as you guys wanna see as far as summer wardrobe essentials go. So we are just gonna get started because there's a lot to share. I just love accessories because they really pull together an entire look. I feel like they just complete it. So I'll be sure to link everything below. I have coupon codes for some of the items. I'll have it all listed out below in case you wanna refer back to it. And if you are new here definitely consider hitting subscribe and you're gonna have to comment below which piece was your favorite because there's a lot of favorites for me so you guys are gonna have to help me pick out your favorites so I'm wearing some of my favorites today too so we're gonna get started into necklaces let's start with Miranda Fry and then we're just gonna go on to all the other ones so all my Miranda Fry favorites I do have a coupon code I'll have it listed here for 10% off plus for you shipping on any Miranda Fry purchase um, so the first one is, it's two different separate like pieces to purchase. So first is the butterfly charm. I'm gonna have close-ups on all of these, but this butterfly charm has been a favorite of mine as well as yours. Actually, I had so many of you message me saying that you ordered it. It's really beautiful. Like butterfly could be a symbol of a meaningful thing for you. And when the great thing about the Miranda Fry charms is you could mix and match. There's so many different charms on their site. Like I have an initial charm from them and I have a star one, which I could show you guys that next. I have a star one. So they're really inexpensive and you could just like wear them so many different ways and they just make one necklace. You buy like one chain there. I love their chains. They're like really high quality. This is a Miranda Fry chain, really great. So you get multiple necklaces for really inexpensive. You really just can't go wrong with the Stephanie necklace from Miranda Fry. It has one crystal in the center. It reminds me of a Tiffany & Co necklace. So it's definitely a designer dupe for way, way less. and. I've just had so many of you guys tell me you brought these as gifts for people or for yourselves. It really is a top seller and it's just like the best. Um, I believe this is 16 inches. Um, you'll see what they look like on me as far as how they lay, but they're, it's definitely a shorter necklace. I love layering that Stephanie necklace with this arch necklace from Miranda Fry and it's beautiful. Like I wear this where it lays all the way at the bottom. Then I put the Stephanie up top and then I'll also do like a Kate choker or another choker that I have that's new is this one from Miranda Fry. I can't remember the name of it, but it'll all be linked as I said. Um, this is a choker and it's super cute. It's like a chain choker, but it's still like kind of delicate, but it makes a statement at the same time, if that makes sense. So I definitely love this one. And this also has a ton of different slots to adjust it which is really nice. And then one that lays a little bit higher up, I wouldn't necessarily say this is a choker, but this is just, again, a shorter necklace. This is the star necklace. This layers nicely with the necklace I'm about to show you a little bit in a little bit. Then the other Miranda Fry piece, this is the last one I share with you guys, is this mini scarlet heart chain. It is so delicate. It is just a really mini heart, but they just sparkle in the light. And what's great about Miranda Fry, it just has that beautiful sparkle. The quality is just insane. I have had nothing but great things. My necklaces have never tarnished. Um, and I've had some of them for so long, like so many pieces for so long and they've never tarnished on me. And that's saying a lot because um, at the end of the day, like these are all costume jewelry pieces. That says a lot about how the amazing the quality is. Um, but yeah, really, really great. I mean, I wouldn't recommend just like going in the swimming pool with them on and like in the shower with them. You know, I'm keeping them on all the time. I definitely would take them off and if you're gonna be in water, I mean, one time probably won't hurt it, but I don't recommend it. Um, so definitely, so you still wanna take care of the pieces, but they are amazing quality. All right, since I've just talked about this mini chain, as I said, it's not a choker, but it's very short. Um, I also have it paired with this other one. Now these are not Miranda Fry, so I'll still obviously have them linked, but now we're gonna move on to the other brands. So this is like a double heart chain again very delicate it's one open heart and one closed heart like filled in and i love it paired with the scarlet chain as i said so these two make a really good pretty like layering piece i love layering most of the time although this is something i'd wear one at a time and it's this like really big statement piece it's really cute in like a chunky chain i got this from shop bop and it has just a little hook in the back and it's just 
so cute. Next one, again, this is something I've had for so long. You probably have seen this if you've been on my channel. It's this initial necklace. Isn't it so cute? So you get your initial in it and I just love it. It makes a little bit of a statement. This actually is something, again, you could wear this a little bit more on its own. You don't have to layer this one as much. If you want just something easy, effortless, sometimes I'll just throw this on when I just don't have the time to throw on a bunch of pieces. This is really great. And I just, I'll put it against my hair so you can see the contrast. Yeah, it looks really, really pretty. And again, great quality. I've had this for years. I also love this chain necklace. This has been super popular. Um, this is a little bit more like a, uh, a yellowy gold has like a little clasp that you just open and again it sits up a little bit higher on your neck but it's super pretty then as i mentioned with that five star necklace from miranda fry i love this necklace pair with it because it hits a little bit longer like in the center of your chest and it's just so pretty it has two gold stars it does come in silver a lot of these pieces come in silver by the way i'm just a gold girl <laughs> lately but i have been like slowly bringing in some silver uh, but this is really pretty it's so, it's so cute layered with that star necklace, but even on its own, again, it just makes a little bit of a statement. I've worn that star necklace actually with this dress before too, on a vacation. It was really, I like the combination. So my last three necklaces, I have this heart necklace that so many of you guys have been loving. I love it so much. I've been wearing it on repeat like a ton. It comes in a ton of other like stone colors in the middle and I have the rose gold metal. And then we have these two Kendra Scott necklaces that are just like, quintessential necklaces. I feel like these are really good necklaces to have in your collection because they're not going out of style. None of these really are going out of style. Probably the only trendy piece is like this one right here, the big chunky heart one. But the rest, they're all delicate. So they're not gonna go, they're not gonna go out of style. So you, you're gonna have them for years. Um, I love this like Druzy stone necklace from Kendra Scott. This is like their classic collection. And then I also just love this like light champagne gold and blush pink stone, but these come in tons of other colors, like tons. So if you could just pick out your birthstone or just your favorite color, of course, I'm sure most of us will want the pink, but uh, yeah, this blush pink is very, very light and it's beautiful. We're gonna move on to some rings. I love a good ring stack. So let's talk about what I'm wearing actually. So we'll start with my thumb ring. This I actually got for my birthday from my mom. It's beautiful. I actually don't remember the brand of it, but I'll ask her where she got it. Um, it's really pretty. It's so delicate. And I believe she's at Nordstrom, but I don't know the brand. Um, and then I also have this heart ring. This So I have two different heart rings. I'll actually show you both now. So the one I'm wearing is a filled in heart and it has a little bit of shimmer and sparkle to it. Um, definitely so pretty, just stacked with so many different other rings or even on its own as a statement. And then I also love this other one. These are both Miranda Fry, these two heart rings. Um, this one that's like an open heart, a lot more bling to it. So if you like a little bit more sparkle uh, and this really sparkles in the light, like when you're in that certain lighting where like jewelry just like really sparkles, this is gonna be like amazingly beautiful, even more beautiful. This open heart ring is adjustable. Like you could squeeze it together and adjust it while the other one is not adjustable if that's something that makes you wanna pick one or the other. Okay, then the rings that are next to my filled in heart ring. So again, I don't remember, I can't remember every single name of every piece, but the two little crystals on top are in a pair. And then the little diamond shape at the bottom is beautiful stacked with them that's sold separately, but it's so pretty. I love it so much. So those are the rings that I'm wearing. A few others, I showed you guys this heart ring. Let's talk about this Pandora ring. I recently got into Pandora. I was on my trip to Boca Raton, was it? Yeah, we were at the mall there. They have a beautiful mall in Boca Raton. Back in February when I went, it was so beautiful. It was end of January actually. Anyways, so I got this for my ring finger on my right hand. It's a heart like ring. It's just like sideways hearts and it's in rose gold. So Pandora has really pretty rings too. Um, great for stacking. Let's talk bracelets because that's another one of my like favorites. Okay, let's be real. All these are my favorites. <laughs> okay, so this next one, you've probably seen me wear this a lot if you've been on my channel. It's a set of five stretchy beaded bracelets, but they have so much like, they're not sparkly as in like, they're not rhinestone, but just the way that they're shaped, like the gold pieces are shaped that they like just sparkle in the light like so much. I don't even know if the camera's gonna do them justice, but you could just do like three if you don't want like such a big stack, you could just do two or one or whatever. Um, or you could do all five like I usually do and it just really fills in your wrist and they're really inexpensive and you get a lot 
you know, you could do so much with them. Another thing I'm loving is, so this chain heart charm necklace or necklace bracelet is so beautiful. It has like a little, it is a little hard to get on. I will say that, um, but it's beautiful. So, um, definitely love this one it's just stunning and very unique and then i just paired it with two a little i think they're like gold filled um beaded bracelets so yeah definitely super pretty love those these are like some of my go-to stacks recently i do have a tray of other jewelry because i have a tray guys okay, look at this let me see these are really heavy trays i have this tray of necklaces and then that's and now it's like falling over um and then i have this tray of other all the goodies all right, so let's talk some more bracelets. This is a really affordable find. If you're looking for just a stretchy bead bracelet that's super inexpensive, these are under $13. Um, they're from Target and it's like a blush pink and marble and like, like brushed gold. I guess you would say, of course, these are probably not gonna hold up for years. They're Target. So, I mean, you get what you pay for, for sure, at most of the time, I'd say. Um, but these are cute just to have for a season or two. Um, and they're just like so unique and cute to wear like even like as a beachy or like pool look with your swimsuit or like just every day, like even with a cute tank and denim shorts, like this totally pulls the whole look together. I love those. Let's see. Oh, wrap bracelets, especially for me during summer, like these Victoria Emerson ones. I believe when I'm posting this, these are 40% off. I love a good wrap bracelet like these, especially for summer because they're just so casual and they just add a little sparkle. So I have a ton of them, but these are just some of my favorite colors. I'll have a close up because yeah, it's easier to see. Some pinks, some like just neutrals. They have tons of like, I've seen like beautiful turquoise on their website. So check it out. Um, because they're like so pretty for especially for summer i wear them like all year round so it's not just a summer thing but they're especially cute for summer this next one is two actually kendra scott pieces they're beautiful this um bracelet they're both adjustable which is great so for pretty much any wrist size it will fit you just pull the little tab or whatever right here and it just adjusts super easy you could do it by yourself um, i love this white one it just has a it, when it hits the light it reflects different colors so it's kind of like a like a rainbowy effect to it like a pastel but it's so pretty so i love the white and then it has like little flecks of different colors in it which is so cute when it hits the light and then i love this bar bracelet again these make really good stacking bracelets or even just on your own and really good gifts too um and then let's see well, share my watch favorite because I'm like always wearing this watch and it's like to me it's a really good dupe for the Michelle watches which has always been on a wish list of mine maybe in the future but for now this Vincero watch has been a favorite of mine so definitely love it I love the like square face I just think it's so fresh and so pretty and still classic and this comes in all the different tones of like silver and then I have the matching bangle it has like a, like a marbly look to it like a stone and they come in different sizes, which is nice because I have a smaller wrist and sometimes bangles on me just don't work, but this does. It even stacks nicely with my other bracelets I have on. It's so pretty, it fits my wrist perfectly. You could even pinch it in a little bit more if you wanted to, to like bring it in to lay it nicer. And is that all my bracelets? Yes. All right, earrings. <laughs> I have a few statements, but actually, I've been really into like more delicate earrings lately. It just depends on the outfit, but mostly like the ones I'm wearing, these like little heart lockets have been just a go-to of mine a lot. These might be on sale, I'm not sure. I'll have to look, but as of when I last checked, they are in stock, which is good. It's hard to sometimes, you know, make sure things are in stock for you guys to check out, but I love these because they're just like a mini statement, you know, they're really cute. And then they just go with everything. And then I also love, so if you're looking for a statement, I've had these for years. They're from Waffle Bar. They're just like a, I call them Starburst earrings. I don't really know what they're technically called, but they are really pretty. Like they make a nice statement. Throw your hair up in a ponytail or off your face or even just on like here. And then when your hair like moves to the side, it just like looks so pretty and it just frames your face. Earrings really frame your face. I love these. They're so cute. Another more statement earring that I love are these pearl open heart earrings. Again, look what this dress and this hairband, I mean, darling vibes for sure. Yeah, these are really, really pretty though. I just think they're just ultimately darling earrings. I also love, this as a statement now, this is like the biggest earring I'm gonna share with you guys. These are um, beautiful, they're beaded and they come in different color beads. This is a really good quality one. I've had these for years. 
These are stunning too. Again, they match my dress. And I believe this is the cotton candy color, I want to say. They're definitely more of a pink tone to them, but they have them in neutral and they're just open. They have different styles though. If there's, if you're looking for something a little bit smaller, they do have different styles. I do have these crystally hoops, which are fun if you're doing like, just like a flirtier look. These are really cute because they're hoop earrings and I just love a good hoop. I mean, you can't go wrong with hoops um, and they're a good, price point. Another pair of hoops that are very simple are from Miranda Fry. I love these. Um, these are a small hoop, so they're still big enough to where they're not like so many, but like they're so lightweight. Now, if you struggle with like, you cannot wear a heavy earring, none of these are really heavy, but if you like really want something that you like don't even feel on your ears, this is it. These are like as light as a feather. It's just like crazy, but they're great quality too. But they're Miranda Fry actually. So I love these. I don't even know, they're just so delicate. But like from the side, you could just see the hoop. I just love them so much. Um, and then another Miranda Fry hoop that I actually have is a heart hoop. So they're so fun and unique. So from the front, you don't tell they're a heart. I actually think these would look best with your hair in a ponytail or something off to the side where you could see them more. Because from the side, they're a heart. But from the front, they're just like, you're everyday hoop, which is really nice and unique. They're textured metal as well. Let's do my hair bands because I'm literally having a hair band moment this whole spring and summer this year. I don't know if you guys probably could tell I'm wearing this like way too much. I ordered this hair band in pink, but I think the white is like, this is the Lily Sadoe headbands. For me, I, you know, I bought the dupes, which I have right here. So I had the dupes first. I have the black one. I forgot to pull, but I really don't wear the black one, especially for spring and summer. I like lighter colors. So it comes in like a pack of mauve and like neutral, like a beige. Um, I got these off Amazon. I believe they're still in stock and I will link them. They're great. I absolutely love them. I think they're adorable. But now that I got the Lily ones, I'm just like now like on the Lily Sadoe bandwagon. And now I like want every color and they're just beautiful. They really just pull the whole look together. Like you could see my outfit, like obviously if I'm just like wearing this dress, I think it is still super cute on its own. But I mean, look at when you just put this on, it just pulls the whole look together. I know it's not for everyone, but I really like it. You guys have to let me know. Are you like a headband girl or not? These are so comfortable on your head too. Very, very comfortable. Oh my gosh. So I got the white one. It's still available. I also have this Lily Sadoe one as well. This is the, these are the only two that I own. And as I said, I have like a candy pink one on the way, but I'm like gonna be wearing it now. Get ready for me to wear that one a lot. <laughs> this one is a gingham one from Lily Sadoe. And I believe this was on clearance. So if I could find them in stock, I will link it. Cause this is really inexpensive. Like I'm talking, I think this is like 30 or $40 compared to this one. They are a splurge piece for sure. I mean, they are for sure, but they're definitely, to me, if you have the money to spend on it, I think they're definitely worth it. I just wanna show you guys these hair scarves too. They're super fun for summer. You could put your hair up in a half up, half down, like messy bun. Obviously it looks ridiculous with this hair band in right now, but these like little, this is like a scrunchy hair scarf. You could bow it up and put it around like a messy bun or something. I'll have a picture of me wearing it because this, like this is not gonna make it look great um i also got this one from target it's like a tie-dye one it also again has a scrunchie so you could like put it over like a ponytail i just think it looks so fun so i wanted to include these something a little random but super cute all right first hat this is from an etsy shop i will link their shop they make like custom hats i got out of office written on it but i've seen them do them for like bridal parties and like bachelorette and stuff like that or you put like if you're like a newlywed and you want to like for your honeymoon or something you want to put your last name on it you could do that they have so many different things this is absolutely beautiful and it's well made i took this on so many different vacations last year i'll have a picture of me wearing it but it's absolutely beautiful so i wanted to share that one first i have a lot of straw hats i love a straw hat moment too i'm all about it so I just think it makes it look a little extra. This is definitely a splurge hat, but I love the grow grain ribbon on it. It's like in a mauve color and it just looks so darling. I wore this to the Grand Floridian on my trip to Florida earlier this year. And it was just such a perfect hat to wear. I go to the Grand Floridian with my mom. Um, we go, we love going to breakfast there. It's so good like dreaming of breakfast at Grand Floridian right now. It's amazing. So I wore this and it just felt like very Victorian because it's like a Victorian vibe at 
Grand Floridian. I just love that place. All right, I also have this hat right here. This is from Soul Society. It's beautiful. It's a shawl, just like everyday hat you could wear with a t-shirt and, and like denim shorts. I think it's really, really cute. And then I also have this one. I have to see if this is in stock, but this is like one of my go-tos. I love how well made it is and the brim is just like nice and stiff and it's more of like a statement hat. It's really pretty. All right, we are down to the last category. I love some really cute sunnies, especially now, like lately, I've just been into just getting the designer dupes. I really like them. So this is the first one. These kind of remind me of Karen Walker's. These are in the Milky Tortoise, I think it's called, color. These are really pretty. I'll just try all these on right now for you guys. How cute are these? I love them. They're a little bit more rounded, super pretty. Again, I'd say they're more of a Karen Walker dupe. They're really, really pretty. And then I also, this has like a little bit of a blush, blush tone to the tortoise. This is, oh, let's do the Gucci dupes. These are the Gucci dupes. These have been super popular. And look how cute these are. These are definitely more of a square, like a, not as rounded as the others. Definitely love these. Definitely like give your outfit a statement. And these are all very comfortable on your face. I have these that are like definitely more like cat and kind of on the verge of a cat eye, I'd say statement these are a little bit more well made than the, the other two i just showed you guys so yeah definitely love these these feel very nice and sturdy and well made i also love my round sunnies these are my ray-ban sunnies i love round sunnies this is so cute i like usually would wear these in the past to the beach or the pool definitely more for me like summery speaking of fun these are definitely just more of like for like a little occasion like i've seen like girls wear these to like a bachelorette party and they all like wear the same sunnies. These are a YSL sunny dupe. I feel like these definitely take a certain occasion to wear these. You just wouldn't wear these like walking down the street with these on, but they're definitely like really cute. But I just obviously, I mean, I personally, I mean, maybe you go for it if you want to do it, but I just think they're definitely more of just a fun, you know, if you're gonna take a picture by the pool, like I got these for like a cute pool picture like for Instagram, but, or just like an occasion for like a birthday, like if it's like a pool party or something, these are cute, but otherwise just for every day, I personally wouldn't wear them every day, but they are cute. They're an Amazon find. I would never spend more than like $15 on those. And then I have the other pair of these. I really invested the money and I'm glad I did because they feel the most comfortable out of all the sunglasses and they're the most well-made. They're my Gucci sunglasses. I will see if they're still in stock. I know these have been so popular. Sometimes they do bring them back in stock and on sale, but we'll see. I'll try to link anything similar or whatnot, but love these ones. They're just a really classic silhouette and I'm so happy that I splurged on them. And then the last thing I wanna share that's super fun, it's a summer accessory. I feel like, again, not many people think about, but it just adds something, a little extra to your outfits. It's definitely an extra accessory for sure. So it's a sunglasses, um, it's like a sunglasses holder, I guess. I've seen the sunglass chains, they've been so popular. And you just put them on your sunglasses, you put them through the little loops. All right, so what you do is when you have your sunglasses on, it has this like really pretty chain. I think that's how it's supposed to go. <laughs> yeah, so it has a really pretty chain. And then if you like need to take your sunglasses off, like they're still around your neck, you know, a little bit of, jewelry like for around your neck when you're holding your sunglasses so i i do think this is a really this is definitely on trend like i've seen it so much this year um but it is like really cute and like different i don't know it's just like really chic i feel like so that is everything for my summer accessory essentials hope you enjoyed part two if you are excited for part three with the shoes give this video a thumbs up if you have any other suggestions leave that below along with what was your favorite piece out of this entire video i know that's a really hard question but let's see if you guys can let me know your favorite piece and all links will be in that description box and definitely consider hitting subscribe before you head out i'll have other videos listed here in case you want to check them out and i will see you all in my next video very soon love you guys bye